guys, this is Nikki Simone from Behind the Mic, and I have one of the first runner-ups here. His name is Oak. Oak, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Now, you are from Atlanta, and I read your bio, and it says that you've been doing poetry since you were eight years old. How did you start out doing poetry? I think I was one of them guys that um, kind of just has a lot of interest in literature and English class. And once I started doing that, just kept going. So why did you decide to become a contestant at the Stir event? And I know you just finished performing. Um, I have found, about it, found out about it through Facebook, um, and I found out that other poets were doing it. So let me just give it a shot. And I gave it a shot, and I was the runner-up. I'm going to keep on, you know, growing, practicing my craft, um, just getting building on it and keep networking. You never know what it's going to take you to. And who inspires you? Right now, I'm going to say Queen Shiva. Okay. Yeah. And why? She's ill. I mean, just her content, her delivery, and her experience and her background. So, uh, again, we just had said you just finished performing. And what the crowd, what do you say about the crowd tonight? They got a lot of energy. Yes. A lot of energy. And they're good looking, too. Okay. Everybody dressed up, dressed right. for success, right. you know. So, right. now I'm trying to hang with them, the big dogs. But um, they have a lot of energy. And, they, and they, you can tell they enjoy art. You can really tell they enjoy art. And what piece did you actually perform today for us? The piece that I did today was called Hands, um, about the best violence. Um, I feel that a man has other options with his hands versus to hit a woman. And I expressed that through my poem. Wow, um, now that's a pretty heavy piece. Yeah. Why, why the passion for that type of piece? When I found out that every nine seconds a woman in America gets beat, I said that's unbelievable. And it expired that poem. Immediately I just started going with the pen. And once I started going and it came out, and I noticed too once I do that piece, I can express it more. I have so much passion about that piece. I am Oak Morris. You can find me on Facebook and Twitter, O-A-K-M-O-R-S-E. I'm a poet, and you'll be seeing me soon. Hey, guys, this is your girl, Nikki Simone, on Behind the Mic Life. And, of course, we are here at Stir Event. I have life coach. Miss JL, how are you? I'm good, how are you, beautiful? I am wonderful. Now, I saw you doing your thing. What type of things were you guys talking about? Relationships, everything relationships, knowing who you are. The key to, to having a successful relationship is loving yourself. You have to know who you are and you have to be whole in order for you to have a successful relationship with somebody else. Two broken people don't work. So what have you found to be the biggest problem, concern in relationships? Not knowing who you are not having self-esteem and not valuing yourself. So if you have people that are, are coming to you and you're not valuing who you are, you accept anything. And when you know who you are, you won't accept anything because you know your worth, you know your value. You, you know what I mean? So a lot of people have to work on that, on knowing who they are and really loving themselves and knowing what they deserve. And then, when, because we're gonna meet all kinds of people, but when you know who you are, you'll know who to choose. And you'll know who to say, you know what, we can be, we can be friends or, or acquaintances, but that's it. Mm. It's okay to say no to somebody. Where, do you have this on the road? Are you taking a tour? I, I mean, what projects are you have going on? I do. I life coach. I life coach. So if you want to have any life coaching sessions with me, you can reach me. Um, everything is Jael, my name, J-A-E-L, the great. So I'm at Jael, the great on Twitter. You can Facebook me, inbox me, email me, Jael, the great at Gmail. But I do life coaching. I also do public speaking. So if you want to book me to speak at any of your events, I encourage you, I build you up to let you know who you are and you're worthy of every great thing in this world.